My name is Tiffany. I'm a fat yoga teacher trying to make yoga more accessible to everybody. All right, so let's get started. Let's find a grounding position in a chair. Feet are flat onto the earth. Maybe just wiggle the shoulders, feel into your body. Let go of any energy that has been built up from Christmas or anywhere else in your life. Shake it out. <sighs> Take a deep inhale. Open mouth, exhale. Oh, let it all go. Deep inhale here. Open mouth, exhale. Oh, hands come to the legs. Shoulders away from ears. We sit tall here. Begin to breathe in through the nose and out through the nose, finding that ujjayi breath. So sipping in the air, counting to four, five, or six, and then exhaling to that same count. Inhale for four, exhale for four. Inhale for five, exhale for five, and so on. This is your ujjayi breath. Let it flow within you. As we move through the practice, I just want to remind you that today we're just sticking with the basics. We're going to go and just have a review. So let's just focus on our bodies and how we feel within our bodies as we practice. So as we practice, think of the words, I am present. Inhale, I am. Exhale, present. Eyes still closed. We sit up tall. Take the right ear to the right shoulder. Find the stretch on the left side. And then next inhale, we come back up to center. Left ear goes to the left shoulder on the exhale. And we find stretch on the other side. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, lower down to the right shoulder. Stretch again. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, lower the left ear to the left shoulder. Stretch other side again. Roll your neck into a couple of neck circles. Going slow, feeling into it. I still close your friends. Go in the opposite direction at least one time, maybe two. Moving slowly and just kind of tapping in. I am present. On that next exhale, we come back to center. Sit tall, open the eyes, let yourself acclimate to the light of the room. Inhale, we circle the arms all the way up, press the palms together, and exhale, we bring them back to our heart center. Inhale, we circle, press the palms. Exhale, we bring them back to our heart center. One more time. Inhale, circle. This time, reach the arms back like we're swooping, making a dive, and then press the palms together. And on this one, we take our feet out a little bit in front of us as we slowly lower, finding our forward fold. Hands just dangle here, chin to chest, roll, shoulders roll forward. Take a deep inhale, we lift a little bit, and then exhale, we fold a little bit. On that next inhale, we rise all the way back up, stretching your arms all the way up to the sky. Right hand comes down, left hand comes up, an overside stretch. Inhale, back up to center, exhale, left hand comes down, right hand comes up, an overside stretch, other side. Inhale, both arms come up, we reach up, look up, find an arch in our back, and exhale. Bring our hands back to center. Shake it out, friends. Anything you need right now, sip of water, remove a layer, tap into it. Let's sit tall and flow through a couple of sun A's, or maybe half sun A's, these are. Inhale, we circle, press the palms together, exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, find our half lift, exhale, we fold. Inhale, we circle, press the palms, exhale, we fold. We've done this so many times now, friends. Inhale, lift, exhale, fold. Inhale, rise, circle the arms, press the palms one more time, exhale, we fold. Inhale, lift, exhale, we fold. Inhale, we circle, press the palms, and exhale, we come back to center. All right, friends. Let's do our last pose, goddess. Let's do goddess. Feet are flat onto the earth. Knees are open up wide. And it's like both cheeks are on, but barely on. So press. <laughs> press it. See, I was trying to press it in my feet. So adjust yourselves if that doesn't happen. <laughs> press into the feet. Feel strong here. Hands can be here. You can find a cactus shape, squeezing those shoulder blades together, or your arms 
arms can be up or out to the side. Like, what do you need in your arms right now? Strength, feeling it in our legs. Engage your core. And then exhale, we come back to center. Shake it out. One more time, we find our goddess. Lean into it. Maybe this time it can stay at heart center or we go right back to cactus. Engage your, your core. Lift your chest. On that next exhale, we go right back to center. Inhale, we circle. Press the palms together. Exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise. Find our half lift. And exhale, we fold. Inhale, we circle. Press the palms and exhale. Come right back to center. All right, friends. We're done with chair. You're more than welcome to continue in a chair. But my next, my next version will be standing with a chair. All right, friends. Standing with the chair, standing with the chair. Let's do this, stand in front of your chair. Make sure your chair is on your yoga mat, all four corners of the chair. You don't want the chair slipping away. Let's inhale and circle the arms all the way up. Press the palms together and exhale, we fold all the way back down. Inhale, we rise, find our half lift. Exhale, we plant our palms onto the chair and we step our feet to the back. Find our plank, engage your core here. Lower down for Chaturanga, lift back up. <laughs> shift your hips forward for Upward Facing Dog. And then shift them back for Downward Facing Dog. It's almost like an L shape again. Relax your head, relax your shoulders. On that next exhale, step right, step forward with your right foot. Find your halfway lift, stick your booty out. Exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, circle arms. Press the palms together and exhale, we come to Shake it out, friends. Last move, these guys. Scooters. Okay, so move your chair to the front. Our feet are tracking over our knees, so toes face out. Take a wide stance here, so as we, we sit down, our booty don't have to push back. Okay, so chest is lifted. Engage your core and then lower down. Lower down a little, lower down a lot. Okay, engage your core, lower down. Add your arms, maybe one arm, maybe both arms. Squeeze your shoulder blades. Hands can also be heart center or on the hips. Take a deep breath, exhale, we straighten our legs, circle the arms all the way up. Press the palms together, come back to center. Maybe we switch sides for your arms. And we lower down again, but the gut is. <laughs> Take a deep breath here, friends. On that next exhale, we straighten our legs, circle the hands all the way to the top, press our palms together, and exhale, we come to our heart center. Ooh, ooh, ooh. shake it out. <laughs> wow, that was really awful. <laughs> we can go ahead and move our chair right to the front. Inhale, we circle, press the palms. Exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, find our half lift. Exhale, we plant our hands, step our feet to the back. Find your plank and lower down. Push back up. Find your upward facing dog and your downward facing dog. This time we step our right foot to the front. Find our half lift. Exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, circle arms. Press the palms and exhale. Come back to center. All right, let's move down to blocks. <laughs> we the exact same routine, just on blocks. All right, let's inhale and circle the arms. Press the palms and exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, find our half lift. Exhale, we plant our palms onto the blocks and set our feet to the back. And if you don't have blocks, you can just be on the mat. I like to take my chaturangas from the knees. Engage your core, lower down, push back up, and then shift your hips forward to find your upward facing dog. And then shift your hips back, tuck your toes, Maybe you stay here with knees down, or maybe you lift up your knees and find your downward facing dog. Relax your neck, look to the back of your mat. On that next exhale, we walk our feet to the front. Find our halfway lift, and exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, circle arms, press the palms together, and exhale. Whew. Let's come to the side of the mat, and toes are out. We are in goddess. This is our last move. <laughs> our last move, our last move. Squat down, hands to heart center. We feel it, we feel it, we feel it. We got us in it, and then we straighten our legs. And then we feel it again. <laughs> I'm in a weird mood today, friends. And then we straighten our legs. And then one more time, this time cactus arms. We squeeze it, we squeeze it, we squeeze it, squeeze, 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 squeeze. And then exhale, straighten. <sighs> Sit our feet together. Shake it out. Come to the top of the mat. Inhale, we circle. Press the palms. Exhale, we fold. 
find your half lift. Exhale, we plant our palms, step our feet to the back. Find our plank, lower down for chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, maybe child's pose. Sit your hips back, arms out to the front, relax your neck. Go ahead and come back up, lift up your booty and walk your feet to the front of the mat. Find your halfway lift and exhale, we fold. Inhale, we rise, circle arms, press the palms, and we come back to center. And that's it, friends. If you have followed along with me on this 90 day journey, I commend you. I appreciate you. You are my people and I love you. I hope you've enjoyed this as much as I've been able to enjoy providing this to you. This will be on my channel forever. So if you need to ever come back to this, you can, it is here for you. And that's why I'm keeping it here. I wanna be able to make more accessible yoga practices for people who feel like they can't do yoga. I appreciate you friends and thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you haven't already, subscribe. I really would appreciate it. And I love you so much.